We're off on an expedition to explore the ocean depths and bring back wonders of life in the forest beneath the sea. We prepare to enter another world. However, the problems of our voyage along the ocean floor are not solved as easily as one might think. There is constant movement in the ocean, a movement of terrific force. There are tides, cross currents, and countless other submarine difficulties to combat. And the captain appears pleased with the expedition so far. The fish seem to welcome her to the undersea world. Down behind our magic window, we look out in amazement, for we are actually down among the mysteries and the wonders of the sea. Fathoms deep, with crushing water pressures all around. And here's a funny-faced parrotfish. Nature has fitted him for a diet of rocks. I hope he keeps his teeth out of my business. A school of them once attacked my priceless glass window and made it look as if someone had skated on it for a week. Did you ever see a sponge as big as a bathtub? They grow that large and in curious shapes. Bathe in the light rays. Other fish bank up mysteriously. They seem at peace, but their eyes show they are alert and watching a deadly enemy. Life and death are a matter of moment in the fish world, where one kind devours another. More fish, alive and kicking. The poor fish seem to take it all philosophically. If one fish is swallowed by another, it's bad. If two fish are gulped down, it's just too bad. Yet life with all its perils and suspense seems free from care in the lovely gardens of the sea. <laughs> 